Hello guys, uh, this is a short video uh, and in this video I'm going to cover the RII8 uh, keyboard type remote. Uh, a lot of people ask me that they have auto the remote but it does not seem to work. Uh, well, uh, there is a dongle that comes with the uh, remote and you need to uh, fix the dongle on the USB ports of the box in order for it to work. So, where can you find the dongle? The dongle is on the back side under this cover under the back cover which is covering the battery of this remote so you just need to take this covering out you can see there is open written on this uh, lid so I will just drag it and you will see this opens up and after that you can see there is a battery and there is the dongle so I will just take out the dongle so we have the dongle and I will put the cover back on the remote so the cover is back and we have the dongle so the dongle needs to be fitted onto the USB port of the box which is on the side of the box. So I will just fit this dongle onto the USB port now. So this is in already. So now our remote uh, can work and um, it can function, the trackpad can function. But you need to make sure that the on and off switch which is on this side, on the right hand side of the remote, you need to, make, uh, you need to turn that on. So I'll go ahead and turn that on now. You can see that the blue LED is flashing or is on on the uh, yeah, keypad. So and there's another USB mini USB port which can be used to charge the keyboard. It has a chargeable battery and you will get the USB mini USB cable with this uh, keyboard. You can use the mini USB cable to fix one end of the USB cable on this remote and the other end will go onto the USB port of the box and then you can charge uh, charge the key, keypad so uh, this should work fine now if you can just see the screen and I'm trying to use the trackpad and you can see that the track is moving the cursor is moving on the box and it makes it very easy to use I will press it and you can see it, it makes it very easy to use and I can use the up and down arrow keys and it's going up and down and other things can happen and one thing more before I close this short video uh, on this uh, on this uh, keypad usually people are, are asking that uh, there is a problem with the uh, add rate of key so this add rate of key if you see a normal uh, computer keyboard and you want the add rate of key you will have to press shift and and 2 so uh, for this keyboard also for getting the add rate of key you will need to press shift and the letter uh, the digit 2 so you will see the add rate of sign on, on the uh, on the screen so just press the shift and the 2 and you will get the add rate of sign on the screen if you ever need it and rest I think that's perfect uh, that works perfectly with all the all the boxes so that's it for the short video and I'll be bo uh, back with more videos and uh, more simple instructions on how you can use your box and how you can get the best out of your boxes. So thanks for watching this. Thank you. Bye-bye.